Wagwan, it's a boy here, Yardy Gamer, and I'm here playing some Elder Scrolls Online. And you know, um, I think a few weeks back, I was going to make a video showing you guys 1 to 50 um, grind spot that I used to, you know, to level up my character all the way from 1 to 50, all the grind spot I used. But I found a faster way and a more easier way of grinding. And it's pretty much, you don't have to fight people over XP, you know, and all of that stuff, and running around, and stealing mobs, and all of that stuff. And it's pretty easy. One of my friends, um, Predits, um, he's the one who told me about this. And, um, it's pretty dope, I have to say. I leveled my, um, my Templar up yesterday. It took me around three days to level him from 1 to 50. You could have done it in two, or even maybe less, if you were a super, you know, grinder. You know, so, but this one... Um, you can do it with um two um two people. You can do it with a friend, and you can do it solo. But I, I would say do it with a friend because it's much faster when you do it with a friend. And I was looking um I think it was yesterday. Um, there's a guy um I think his name is Cody. He does um Elder Scrolls Online video as well. He was doing one, but for another um for another area. So this is um, where you want to be for this one. I don't know what um area you um what level you have to be for the other areas to unlock Fungal Grotto, but Fungal Grotto is where you want to be. So. Let's go ahead and head into Fungal Grotto. Oh, I'm going to show you on the map where it is. I forgot to do that. When I get in here, I'm going to show you on the map where um, Fungal Grotto is for the EP and uh, for everybody else. I don't know what level it unlocks for everybody else, but I know for um, for us, for Ebonheart Pack, we can come here as soon as we come out of the prison. The, the mobs in here will be at level 10, but you can come in here as soon as you come out of the prison. Because I came out of the prison last night and I was level 4. And I did this once, and it got me to right where you see that bar is right now. I just came in here and I did this once, and it's not even that long. So let me just go ahead and show you guys on the map where Fungal Grotto is. So this is in Stone Falls, Ebon Heart Pack. As you can see, you know, I'm level 5, and I've just, like, this is, I jumped and cut the whole area because I jumped to um, a guy in one of my guilds, and uh, he was over here, and I just traveled over here to get there. And there it is, so Fungal Grotto. So when you get in here, so what you want to do for this now, you want to run up here, right? These two guys here are going to help you out. This guy here and this, I don't know if he's a guy or a chick or whatever. So what you want to do is you want to aggro them, right? Then you want to back up, back all the way up, back up, back up, just back up. This is why you can do this one solo. So you back up right here till he grabs aggro. So when he grabs aggro now, no, all you have to do is hit all of them at least once. Hit all of these ones in the back here that are not aggro once or is they'll run back. You see, he ran back because I didn't do much damage to him. They will run back if you don't do as much damage to them. So what you want to do is you want to want to hit him again. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm a crystal frag ass. Oh, shit. Oh, I really should get a staff. Yeah. But I'm trying to level up my dual wheel. Okay, so here we go. Everybody's all aggro. So you see, alright, let me just show you something, alright, when you die, it don't really matter, you just respawn right here, don't matter, you're gonna die a lot in here, so alright, let me get this guy here really close, and I'm gonna show you something, alright, yeah, he's really slow, so when he kills him, just look at my XP bar down there, and look at that jump, you saw that jump just now, that was a ridiculous jump, and that was me using it without, without, look at, look at my current buffs that I'm using, I own an ESO Plus member right now, and if I had gone to the store and got the um, the XP potion here, which is right down here, the experience potion for ten, um, for 1,000 crowns for five, for, and it lasts for two hours. So when you're grinding, this is the ideal place to do it. If you're gonna, you know, if you're gonna grind, you know, you don't want to do quests and get that XP potion. That's just a waste. Cause riding on your horse, you're wasting your two hours. So if you're gonna use that XP potion, please come here and grind. This is the way to do it. And please hurry up and do this before it got patched. And that's why I'm doing this video. You know, to just aware you guys of this, um, you know, this pretty much awesome grind spot, really. Look at my bar right there. And this is what I'm going to go do. I'm going to go grab the next mob. And then I'm just going to pull them back here. If you have a friend, while those mad mob mobs are aggroed, you can come back here and pull these ads over here, over there to your friend. And just aggro all of them. And normally what I would do is, um, I think I'm going to put a video right, you know, right somewhere around here.
right, so they're all that. Nope, this one. All right, so that's how my bar move up after coming in here once. Now, what you want to do now, you want to you want to go to your um, friends list and you'll invite a friend or a friend that you know. You know, you invite him to the group. So you can invite him to the group while you're in here and then disband it, or you can go outside, invite him to the group, and then disband it. And I'm just running over here just to show you something. You don't want to come over here and grab this next um this next mob over here. There's a next mob over there that you don't want to grab. That's the first boss. And the reason why you don't want to grab him is because if you die doing that boss fight, he will um he will uh you will you can't revive and you have to sit there and wait for those two guys to DPS him down. Now if you have your XP um boost on, that's gonna be a long time and you're wasting a lot of time out of your XP um XP potion, you know, so don't do that if you're doing your XP potion because he's a boss and you know as I said you pretty much should only try that if you have a friend with you that you can do it with you know because if you're doing that solo trust me it's gonna waste your potion because these guys are gonna take him down but they're gonna take a while to take him down and that's pretty much it man I mean look at it look at how far my bar go and that's just from one run just clearing these two rooms out and that wasn't even like what that wasn't even 10 minutes really I mean the video hasn't even hit 10 minutes yet so um, you can and when you disband the group it's instant so as soon as you disband the group you can come right back in here and this you can do this all the way up to 50 as I said I did it all the way up to 50 on my on my other character that I have so what you, uh, when you do it solo you have to go outside and you have to wait for it to reset I don't know any faster way of resetting it if somebody know please put in the comment section below and help everybody else out because I don't know how to do it I mean all I can do is um go out here outside go do something else like go farm some materials and wait and, uh, in five minutes and then i go back in but you know like i'll come out here and then i'll find somewhere to go and farm some materials or whatever and then i'll just come back in because you can teleport to the dungeon like if you at a way shrine you just hover over it and you can travel to the dungeon no matter how far away you are so that's a, a quick little way of getting back into the dungeon you know and that's about it i hope this video was helpful get that grind on before they patch this guys